Hi, and welcome to my tutorials on Euclid's Elements, Book 4. This video presentation is going to be on Proposition 8 of Book 4. In this proposition, we are going to describe the methods required to draw a circle inside of a square, where the circle touches each side of this square. To do this, first we're going to bisect the two sides of the square at point E and at point F. Then we're going to draw a line parallel to AB starting at point E. And likewise we're going to draw another line that is parallel to AD from point F. And from here, we are going to take GE as our radius, and we're going to draw a circle. And this circle touches all four sides of our square. To prove this, now because all the lines are parallel to each other, AF is equal to EG is equal to DK, which is equal to FB, GH, and KC, and similarly, all of these individual lines are equal to each other. And if we look at slightly larger parallelograms, AB is equal to EH is equal to DC. And we look at the horizontal parallelograms, we get AD is equal to FK is equal to BC. And since this is a square, AD is equal to AB. And since E and F bisect the sides of the square, AE is equal to AF. And with all these equilaterals and parallelograms and all these lines being equal, we have that GE is equal to GF, which is also equal to GH, which is also equal to GK. And since these four small lines are equal, we can start at the center of G and draw a circle, and all of these lines will terminate at the circumference of the circle. And since the angles E, E, F, and K, and all of these are all right angles, this being a right angle, then this line will touch the circle. Since this is the center of the circle, this is the radius, this angle here is a right angle, consequently this line touches the circle, and the same can be said for the other three sides of the square. So consequently, or as a result, we have now shown that we have drawn a circle inside the square such that it touches each side of the square. And that concludes this video presentation. To see the next presentation, just click the next button.